came to Tiferet because it's such a warm environment, and since it's a warm environment, it helps you learn on a deeper level. I went to a challenging high school, so for me, it was very important to have some challenging classes. I wanted teachers I can have a close relationship with. I wanted education that would last me and help me build a foundation for the rest of my life. It seems to be like the perfect fit for me. I couldn't picture myself elsewhere. My teachers and my rabbis, they know more than my name. They know where I'm from, who I am. Since the teachers know us so well, they've really tailored their curriculum towards us. There are a lot of classes in Tiferet, and I chose classes that I thought were based on my level of learning and what I was interested in learning and what could make me grow the most. One of the reasons we offer around 70 different classes is because we realize that students come at a variety of different levels and with a variety of different interests. Twice a week we go to VODs at our teachers' houses. It's like an informal learning. Everyone grows in her own way and we really try to do our best as the faculty of the school to nurture that. And you really feel like your voice is being heard and that you get to learn what you want to learn, not just what the teachers are telling you. I meet with every student in the school personally, and I make sure that everything in the program's working for them. Everything's tailor-made. As I started taking the classes and actually understanding what the teachers were telling me, I started to really like connect with all my classes. You're my hope, and my feet never touch the ground. Cause your arms around. Oh, I our honors track gives students the opportunity to learn Torah on the highest possible level. The Dr. Rock class is very challenging and text-based. I would like the girls to relate to Tanakh as seriously as they would relate to any science course that they would take. I'm excited to wake up in the morning to go to class. I'm excited to get there early to be like, get a good seat. Academic excellence means more than just lecture style teaching, that it's important to engage the students one-on-one -on -one in a chavrusa. On average, girls have between four to eight chavrusas with teachers. We have a lot of chavrusas with our teachers. Some of them even stay till one o'clock in the morning. It really shows that they are so dedicated and they really want to help you make an impact on your life. It's really all about relationships. It can be range from, you know, just discussing what they did for Shabbos to questions that they might have that they might not want to ask in a classroom, but they can really feel comfortable to ask one-on-one. -on -one. Tifara is really like a family because all the teachers really care about you and they're always there to help you whenever you need. There's a teacher that everyone can relate to. They helped provide my first year of learning with all the tools that I need to help learn on my own. They want you to be able to use what you learned here throughout your life. Learning is not just about text. It's about text along with the experiential. We have a very strong, passionate love for Eretz Yisrael that especially comes alive when we go on our tzulim. It was an incredible bonding experience for us all to be in that together. We really feel like a unit. I feel really connected to everyone. We visit Hara Carmel and we see where Eliyahu confronted the prophets on Hara Carmel. You get to learn things in the classroom and then go out and experience them and it's like the Torah comes to life. Our teachers came camping with us. They're very involved. They really want us to have the best experiences and they really want us to get the most out of our year in Israel. Chesed is a great way for our students to take what they're learning in the classroom and turn themselves into stronger and more capable people who can take responsibility in their communities when they go back. I took on working at a family's house with their eight-month-old son who has Down syndrome. They ended up being my adopted family, and it's so nice because they help me out in so many ways, but I'm also able to give back, especially through helping with their baby. Every week I go to an elderly woman's house, and she's my adopted bubby. She was a Holocaust survivor, so we talk about her life in the camps. I like helping people. I like putting a smile on her face every time I walk into the house. I think it's important for girls to have ownership over their own Judaism because it creates leadership. 
The people who came to T-Ferret, all of them were so happy with their decision. The growth in their commitment really inspires me to be a better teacher and a better role model to them. I want to see Ferris students leave with a deeper level of commitment to Torah, to Halakha, but even more than that, a love for Am Yisrael, a love for Eretz Yisrael, a love of Torah that they will carry over for the rest of their lives.